Salutations, this is Grim Devel. Welcome back to our long play of RimWorld. Uh, a few things. Well, so this episode, we are hoping to start building this barricade. And, you know, hopefully we won't lose too many people when we fight these mechanoids. But it's got to be done, I think, sooner than later. Uh, oh, we can do a little more mining here. Very nice. Um, and I also realized, uh, you know, we're using all of our power on the sunlamp. But we could leave this open. We could leave this roof open. Not a big deal. Um, and maybe I will do that. Just turn this off and um, just t at least temporarily unroof it. It would be nice to, to have this just permanently. So when it, if it gets cold or whatever, not that that's going to happen much here. Um, I think we will remove the roof area for now. Just for now, just right there. Um, and... These things can just grow. And uh, there we go. That'll save us pretty much enough power, I think. Yeah, now it's going back up. Something I realized. Uh, and yeah, that's it. So uh, we don't have a lot of animals left. The animals we have are still starving. Although we've let them graze the hay area, right? We're letting them do that. We're letting them graze both hay areas. And it looks like both can walk. I feel like they should be okay. Um, on, and we have no boom lobes left. They're all gone. So no more chem fuel. Not a huge deal. We do still have a breeding pair of camels, although one is pretty much a, a baby. So that's it's going to be a while. Um, and we do have breeding muffalo. Unfortunately, Blackbird is not one of them. Um, and we are uh, working on this geothermal generator, which I think is a good idea. Uh, do we have the components for it? Not really. I think we're going to have to start mining out some components now. We've pretty much used the ones that we brought. Um, I feel like there's got to be one right there. Can I... Uh... Yeah. That's pretty close. There's some steel over here that's pretty close as well. That'll probably be the next steel place that we go for. Um, and there are definitely components around. All right, I'm a little worried about Dorkling here. We'll see. Uh, Dorkling, how fast are you? You're okay, speed-wise. You're healthy. I don't think they're going to wake up, but I'm a little worried. All right, good job. Good to know. Doesn't take a lot of work. This is the first time that we've built these uh, barricades. This is exciting. This is new in 1.1. Oh, Pablo's going down there as well. Dave, what were you doing? Oh, you're, you're putting stuff into the geothermal generator. Very nice. Very... Oh, the drone intensifies. Yep, it is definitely time. Definitely time. Kim has an extreme... What? That's not Kim. Oh, it's just going through. Kim has an extreme break risk. Now, the psychic drone is for men. And you're not male, so... That's not affecting you. You're just you're just not doing well. Just for reasons. I feel like you should be happier. Unsightly environment outdoors, really. Does the I guess? I guess there's a lot of blood and stuff. Which would be nice to clean up, I suppose. I guess it doesn't rain at all over here. Or very seldom to wash all this stuff away. That is true. Something I kind of forgot about when we did our uh, first Extreme Desert playthrough. So, um, however, like all those years ago <laughs> in Alpha 13. Um, okay. Uh, some Plasteel up there. We don't need Plasteel right now. We still have some in storage. A decent amount, actually. Um, great. Kim is fully healed. That should make her a little bit happier. We're okay on meat for the time being. We've got, uh, 960. Um, and we have started harvesting rice. That's great. And, of course, we've got the hydroponics going on. Very exciting. Look at us harvest this rice. Isn't that lovely? And Mufflu's gonna get some. Oh, we really didn't need that, Pablo. You're just bashing each other's, um... Shields. You're breaking each other's shields. Birdiebot's going to win. You're an idiot, Pablo. What are you thinking? 
Also, I need you. I need you with your rockets. Would you stop it? Just both of you calm down. Just stop it. Okay, good. How hurt did you get? Why do, why do RimWorld colonists love biting each other? All right, you don't get medicine. Probably you can get some herbal meds. Do we have regular medicine? How much do we have? Not a lot. I'm going to say don't use it for this. Um, we are going to want more medicine production soon. We are growing cloth somewhere or cotton, but it's going to be very slow. We certainly don't need as much as we've grown in the past. We have some. Uh, I guess that's all we have is 43. It's not a lot. Um, okay. Buchanan is up. Able to be recruited. It's not very nice in there. Catherine, too. We have so many people that have tried to leave the colony, including Dwarf Comic, who's no longer here because he got kidnapped after he tried to leave the colony. People are upset with how bad everything is, and it's hard to blame them. Uh, I'm doing my best. I'm doing my best, guys. I'm trying. Matrix, where are you going? Uh, oh. Okay. Yeah, I guess soon we can go to limestone instead of sandstone. Mm-hmm. Uh, drop on floor, drop on floor, uh, I will say the same thing there. Do I, I'll let Meritrix finish what she's doing there and then I'll switch these. And we'll start using the blocks that are closer. Good, good, good. Great. Okay. Um, it's gonna be time soon. Good. Pop flow is been patched up. Great. Already about being patched up. We're gonna need both of them. Uh, and the barricade is. We built a, a little bit of it. All right. Soon. Very nervous about it. We're, I can't imagine us getting through this without losing a colonist, honestly, but there's not much growing season. Is it too hot or something? Oh, did we harvest? No. Why is there no, no rice here? Did they... They didn't roof it. Dark. Well, it's constructed roof. Yeah, there's no roof here. I guess it's fine. Did animals eat it did i forget to um yeah animals should not be allowed in here that may have been what happened okay um no more animal starvation shield user has ranged weapon oh yeah uh i don't know why you have a shield honestly We'll drop that when you're awake. Um, uh, Catherine's catatonic. You know what? Maybe it's for the best because you won't break while you're catatonic. And we could definitely use, um, like, things will get better, I think. God, I hope. I think, I think things will get better eventually. We're going to make some bedrooms soon. Uh, we have blocks. We have a few blocks. And we can start making some rooms. Making the other geothermal generator. We need more components. We've got hydroponics going. Things are okay-ish. Better than they were. All right. Um, Pablo can walk. All right. Dorkling, after you eat, I assume... What did we do here? Oh, right. Get rid of this door. I wanted, um, yeah, that's right. Because we wanted something here and something here. That's right. I forgot I did that. I thought I got rid of the other door before I did that. But whatever. Everyone's upset because they're eating nutrient paste, right? 
I guess it doesn't. Eight awful meal, yeah. Awful barrack. We're trying. Maybe if we could put some art in here or something. Or someone could clean it. That would be nice. Um, civilian, what are you doing? Why aren't you cleaning? I don't know. Wake up and do that. Dorkling's recruiting. That is important. I'd like you to work on Buchanan also. It's a shame that Buchanan is not going to be a part of this. Um... Good, now you're going to do Buchanan. Uh, not going to be a part of this battle. Okay, didn't need that. Did not need that, but at least it's kind of in the middle of nowhere here. Um, is that part of the home area? Yes. Someone should go combat that. Good. Thank you, Igor. Hopefully we don't have to rebuild those cables. If we do, that could be a little problematic. No, I think we're going to get in time. All right. Come on, remember? Remember how great it was being a part of this colony, Buchanan? Remember that? All right, drop by 1.5. Not bad at all. Not bad at all. Yeah, you're doing a lot of wardening. Dave, are you good? That's what I was hoping you were doing. Pablo also. Excellent. Right, and Pablo, I want you to drop your shield soon. Give it to someone that needs it. All right, I'm going to make sure these guys stay down here and finish these barricades. Uh, maybe we can hurry up a little bit. They're taking quite a while, aren't they? Good. Uh, okay. Fine. Not the biggest deal. I don't think. Pablo, aren't you pretty good at construction? Yeah, you are. Oh, good. Dorkling's coming to help. Um. Yeah, okay. I feel like now that Dorkling's here, Pablo can go back. Okay, fair. All right, we're getting steel. Are we mining out over here? Not yet, but I think... Well, I guess I need a... Oh, yeah, mining that out. Soon. I think once we're done with that steel, we'll get that. Thank you, Gert. Even though you have one leg. One leg. This is almost ready. I feel like we could do this now, maybe. All right. Get in there, Pablo. Uh, drop that shield belt. Who should have that shield belt? Rinnick, you should have one, right? You do not have one. Um, yeah, go wear that. Uh, looks like we are still running a little low on power. Oh, we had the zzz. That's right. Uh, that drains our batteries totally. We're fine. All right. Thank you for bringing that over here, Dorkling. That's all the steel. And now you're going to attempt to recruit Buchanan again. I think maybe after we do that, we go... What time is it? Yeah, it's like 8 a.m. Then we go fight. We built this. Smell metal from slag. What was it? Um, do until you have... No, just do forever. Um, you can smelt apparel? But only if... Only if it's tainted. Uh, only tainted things. And not... Recon armor or marine armor. Because we might want to use those. Yeah. And what about coded stuff? Like the coded assault rifle that we have. What would that minigun do? Probably not the best weapon. Um, oh, the weapons. Right, that, that would be weapons, not apparel. So this also... Yeah, bio-coded. Only bio-coded. And then 
Yeah, that's fine. Drop on floor. This one also, drop on floor. This one, drop on floor. And then add another smelt weapon. And this one is just non-biocoded, but it's gonna be only certain things. Uh, in fact, no ranged weapons for now. Maybe just clubs. Um, uh, no, that's fine. No, no, no long swords or gladii or maces. Everything else is fine. All right, that'll be good. That'll be good. Uh, and also not if they're like crazy quality. All right. Um, excellent. Is excellent okay? Probably, yeah, for that. Maybe here too, just not... There we go. Otherwise, it might be a good, get a good price. Nice, okay. All right, I think... Oh, good, day's finishing up. I think, I think it, we bring everyone down. Um, let's bring people one at a time here. Um, uh, I'll, I'll tell everyone not to fire at will, too. Rinnick, you come down. Uh, Tango's, yep. Um, don't fire at will. Come down here. Meritrix, come on down. Dorkling. Oh, you were attempting to recruit, but that's okay. Don't fire at will. Hopefully I'll remember to... And Gert, I am worried about you because you, you don't move well, but I'm going to have you maybe come back here because you've got a long-range weapon. Dave, you are you stay there. Civilian, uh, I'm glad you're cleaning blood, but I do need you. Birdiebot, I do need you as well. Tico? Come on down. Yegor, yes, we definitely need you. Kim. Uh, yeah. I already told you to move down. And Pablo, you are important. You got those rockets. In my head, you'd be like, move down here. Okay. Oh man, I'm nervous. That's a lot of mechanoids. God, I'm glad Dave is finishing this up. Uh, I know someone's gonna like break too. It's gonna be bad. Here comes Rennick. It's pretty much everyone. Of course, Pablo's the slowest, but that, that just means that we'll have everyone ready. Okay. Uh, what is the range of these? Not great. I might have you... Come down here and get a little closer to throw those. Okay. Your range. Okay, but you're going to hit people. Yeah, you know what? Get behind there. Okay. Pablo has an extreme break risk. Okay. You're going to fire and get out of there. Um... All right, here we go. I'm terrified. That looks, that looks good. Yegor. Did 
That looks good. Okay. We get back. Come back this way. Wow. Well, the ship's gone. That's great. I can always woke up, which is uh, uh, expected. Pablo, you um, you flee. Igor, come over here. Oh, <laughs> right. <laughs> Fire at will. Um, we this guy, the pikeman, is dangerous because we need to really melee him, but. We need to get rid of these scythers first. I think. Oh, Meritrix, you don't have body armor? That's not great. All right. So far, so good. Oh, I didn't realize one came up to us. Um, Dave, back up. Meritrix, come up here and get... Nope. Right there. Good. Pretty about moved down. So far, this is not terrible. Igor's doing a great job. Okay, you know what? Melee squad attack. Nice. Oh, that's just uh, EMP, which doesn't affect us. Very good. You're all done. Melee. This is all melee now. Fantastic. Wow. I am impressed with myself. This barricade is awesome. Just awesome. Okay. First time we've used one. I mean, they're new, but uh, uh, yeah, claim all this. Uh, unfor Allow it. You all, um, Rinnick, why don't you bring back the advanced components? And the rest of you can bring back whatever. You're not going to bring back anything? Um, bring back those. Oh, you don't haul. Birdie Bob, bring back the. Comp you don't haul either. Right. Okay. Well, then that makes sense. Okay. Okay. What kind of injuries are we looking at? You're fine. You're fine. Uh, Tico did get hit in the head. With the, with the needle gun. That was the pikeman. That's the new thing. That was it. Uh, and it looks like you're going to be okay. Assuming you get in bed and get healed. Oh, that's so much better. Not having that droner makes everything better. Okay. Barricades work. Ladies and gentlemen. Barricades work. Fantastic. Okay. Yeah. That, that'll make all the men feel better. Tico, you're going to go there. Um, and Rinnick, you know what, Rinnick, just go ahead and, first of all, are you, Tico, you, you getting meds? I think you, for your head, let's get you actual medicine. Rinnick, you're, you're good at this, right? I always have to remind myself. Yeah, you're good at it. I'm pretty, I'm always pretty sure. Oh, um, someone killed this iguana for meat. Like a melee fighter. Um. Good, civilian's cleaning. Civilian cleaned up in here. Thank you, civilian. Um, yeah, let's kill that iguana. Uh, Renica's going to heal. Good. Um, another melee fighter around here. Meritrix is feeding. Come on. Okay. Kill that iguana, Meritrix. You're good at melee, right? Yeah, you're pretty good. I don't think it fights back. Birdie bots in a daze. Well, that's no good. Intense pain. Yeah, I guess so. You're going to be okay, though. Unfortunately, it was after the battle. That's the important thing. Uh, what is the muffalo doing down there? That's weird. I guess you're allowed to be wherever. There's no more animal starvation. 
Um, I feel like we should make kibble. Oh, right. We were making this out of steel. Right. We still need 20 wood for that. Uh, and we have trees that are very slowly growing. Okay. If there's a tra a merchant that will uh, sell us wood, we may want to take him up on that. Which is kind of silly, but yeah, we need it. Um, we store compact machine. Oh, yeah, yeah. He knew that was going to happen. We can make kibble. Um, drop on the floor. We want hay. Maybe don't. Yeah, I guess this is all, all right, I guess. Um, let's keep like 400. Which is not that much. And now that I think we're, we have some decent food production going, you know, we have our first rice harvest. Wow, that's a decent amount of rice there. And we, we should be able to start cooking soon. Um, in fact, let's start it. Let's start cooking. That should make Tango's a little happier, too. Uh, let's get you... Do we have sandstone? Yeah, we got sandstone. Actually, don't make it out of sandstone. Make it out of uh, limestone. Uh, all right. Furniture. Cool. All right, and uh, I should definitely put on a cut. That was a good, good one. Good episode, everybody. I enjoyed playing with you today, and I'll see you next time. Bye.